Hello guys and welcome back. This is my first ride, longer ride, um, other than riding up and down the street on the repeat after that sprocket fix. So uh, I'm going on my push button bike. I'm going down to meet with Dave, um, calling at his place and then heading down to the world of speed. There's some news unfortunately from the world of speed and so we're just going down there to pay our last respects. <laughs> That's a cool bike. It's fast as well. How are you doing, Dave? Okay? Oh, yeah. Good. Get all my crap together. <laughs> Looks a lot tidier. You had some time on your hands or something? Not really. <laughs> it's not the same. No, it isn't, is it? You just don't feel the same motivation, do you? What are you doing with the uh, interstate? I was getting some oil leaks up in here. Oh, yeah. I just wanted to check the head and make sure it was tight. Okay. So I got that. There was. I think these were loose. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. So I was getting a little bit of oil there, and so I just cleaned a little bit, and mostly because I wanted this one down in case I wanted to ride it. Oh, cool. <laughs> I gotta put it somewhere, right? I hope you will come over. It would be awesome, or we oh, go I... for a ride. You know, next oh, opportunity, yeah. we'll go for a ride. I might have was trying to do that today, but we can we can do this instead. Okay? Yeah. I was thinking that myself. I was going to come on my commando and I was like, I think it may have wet something, you know, just oh, yeah. push the button and go today. Hi guys, here we are. It's a pretty sad state of affairs, unfortunately. Yeah, the world of speed is closing down. And so, car lot's looking pretty empty. All the cars and the fixtures inside are all wrapped up with blankets and covers over them. I have managed to capture quite a few events over the years. And I've created a little YouTube playlist, uh, if you'd like to go back over them. Uh, mostly motorcycle related, some cars, and uh, most famous, I think, was that jet bike. Oh my gosh, that turbine bike. It was incredible. So I'll include a link here or here, somewhere like that, in this video. And uh, it will be a playlist of some of the bygone events that we've been through. And so all the very best to uh, the volunteers and everyone who put so much time and heart into this organization. And uh, hope to see you again 
at Cars and Coffee one of these days. Oh, and don't forget motorcycles, okay? See you guys. Bye. So unfortunately we received the announcement last week that the board of directors of the World of Speed Museum has decided to close the museum permanently. Yeah, it's very sad. Unfortunately, it's been closed since March the 16th due to the COVID-19 outbreak. I guess we expected that it would open during the summer, but then recently the Oregon governor's announcement with new reopening rules puts the museum into, I think, the second or the third phase, which means that it would be 20. 21 before the museum could even open again let alone questions about what uh, functions or events it could host as well and so as such they've decided to close permanently the world of speed opened about five years ago a big event and a great establishment for our local community they've worked very hard with local high schools and uh, worked on automotive programs with high school students and so unfortunately that goes away now and it's such a shame for all the staff the great staff here and the many volunteers that have put thousands of hours of love and energy into this place as well it's such a shame so this was just a little recap of the world of speed i hope you enjoyed it and uh, if you get the chance take a look at my playlist of some previous events here at the world of speed enjoyed that guys Fantastic guys, see you again soon.